What's going on, people? Please don't mind any errors that I do right now because this is my first YouTube video I'm ever posting and it's definitely worth it. Right here, I got me a delivery that just came for me that I've been waiting for about a month and a half. Uh, this is from Daniel Jewelers. So, gotta definitely say thank you to David and the team over there. I'm making this video because all y'all videos out there definitely helped me a lot. I've done an enormous amount of research on who I'm going to go with. I had a couple in mind. I had CRM Jewelers. I had uh, CMG Links uh, and Daniel Jewelers. And I've been researching it for a long time. So... I'm going to go ahead and open this up for you guys right now because I'm going crazy. I've been waiting to open this thing. Um, and definitely thank you for putting up with me because I kind of, you got to have patience because, you know, these are handmade and, and they take a while with COVID-19 and all that stuff. Um, it, it definitely took a while. Um, I didn't start bothering them till after a month, but I did kind of... I was a, a little bit of a pest trying to find out where it was at. So I did research on this while I'm open. I did research for, for a while and I watch a lot of you YouTubers out there uh, that had your guys's and I ended up going with an eight and a half millimeter. I didn't know whether I wanted to go eight or nine. So I went eight and a half. And one of the things I did was I went out there uh, to Miami I was one of those that was about to get on a cruise in March and I uh, and I was out there in Miami and that was like one of my first stops I said you know if I'm gonna order this online and spend this kind of money I want to go into the store and see what I'm working with and of course I was pleased I don't know any of you who've been in that store before you immediately know uh, that you've got a good person to do business with so also I know they have these new boxes they have uh, these new red boxes with LED lights in it and stuff like that but I chose not to go with that and I asked for one of the old mahogany boxes just because that's that's what I like I like uh, the lacquer finished mahogany boxes so let me uh, so here it is Oh my goodness. Let me see if I can open this up for you to see it with me. Oh, let's see. All right. So, as I've seen plenty of times before, it is wrapped in this paper material. Keep it from getting scratched up. Don't mind my table. I was playing on it, so it's a little... I can see some particles on there, but I figured it'd be a good contrast to showcase the chain. And here it is. It is a beautiful thing. So, he sent me pictures, and I didn't think... Uh, that the links were going to be tight enough, but it is actually beautiful. Um, this is an 8.5 millimeter, and it ended up being 8.65. I'm about to measure it for you guys and weigh it. All right, had to pause the video. I forgot to get a few things, but so this is 14 karat gold. 151.3 grams is what he says. I'm going to weigh it in a second. Um, he says it's about 8.65 millimeters. So I've got the calipers here to test it out. I'm doing this with one hand. So just bear with me. So it's 8.3 millimeters. And 
8.4 so it's about 8.4 millimeters so still happy with that really I wanted the weight to be um, I wanted the weight to be 150 grams and and he got that pretty much spot on we're gonna weigh this in a second here I also did the diamond lettering I'll try to get a shot of that for you looks really nice I asked him to uh, to give me VS diamonds and I'm not an expert on diamonds but I'm definitely impressed with what I see here diamonds are kind of small but that's what you need to fit inside that lettering but the lettering looks really good I did the sleek lock haven't even opened it yet um, there's their logo right there 14 carat very nice very nice chain so here I got the scale here let's see what we got hundred and fifty one point eight so that is right on the money with what I wanted so very very good all in all I definitely do recommend Daniel Jewelers every time I called I never really had a problem um, they were very patient with me as I was with them you know given the whole COVID-19 um, they had a lot going on over there, especially in Miami. I'm in Jacksonville, Florida, or north of Jacksonville, Florida, so um, it's pretty bad up here, but not really like Miami, so I'm sure they had a lot of workload and had some setbacks, but all in all, very good job. Came in just in time. I got a big fireworks show to do tomorrow night, so I've been really preoccupied and also waiting for this. Um, let me show you that lettering one more time. This focus. Yeah, it's definitely. Um, another thing I was worried about is how high up the lettering was going to be. Because I saw another video of how they did it. And it looked like just like a stamped out piece of gold. And I didn't think it was going to be raised enough. But it actually is. I'm pleased with that. Um, sleek lock is beautiful. Chain is beautiful. I think it has just the right amount of weight. Um, I know everybody wants to see the hang straight test, so let me, uh, let me open this. Let me see if I can open this up and do that for you. One second. All right, so here's the hang straight test. It is definitely hanging straight. The thing of beauty. Sorry for the for the blurred video. I'm doing this with my phone, but you definitely get the picture. Um, you know, you know what to expect. Daniel Jewelers, thank you very much again uh, for giving me this wonderful chain. I've been wanting to get one for years, and I finally got mine. If you guys have any questions, let me know. So, I forgot to add this to the video, but definitely wanted to show you guys how it looks on. Um, I had this on for a few minutes right now, and I have to say, it does have some weight to it. It's probably, I mean, I'm going to wear it for a couple days right now and see how it goes, but it's probably the most you want to wear uh, comfortably. It's definitely got a little weight to it, but it feels nice. You know you got something in your, nice in your around your neck, so there's how it looks there. Again, it's 8.5 millimeter, 151.3 grams, 26 inches. That's another thing that I was uh, having having some trouble with is, do I want to go 24? Do I want to go 26? Is 26 too long? But uh, I put another chain on at a friend's house and finalized that 26 is the perfect length. And I do think it is. It's not too long. Any longer, though, I would definitely agree. It's probably too much. Um, to go any longer for me with my taste anyway, but 26 is perfect and um, 
and I couldn't be more happier. So thank you very much to David and Daniel Drewlers and the team out there. Really appreciate it. I'm going to wait a couple months and absorb this hit and buy a medallion for this baby. Peace.